What's up, Go Sold Realty and the Green Key Crew? I am saying hello from one of my favorite places on planet Earth, and that is Pacific Beach uh, here in San Diego. Hey, so Phil and I just finished the marketing conference, um, and we don't fly out for about four hours, so we got a chance to come down to the beach, you know, put our toes in the sand, which I'm doing right now, as you guys can see, grab some tacos and hang out until we fly home and get back to work. But anyway, today, even though I'm not there with you guys personally, it's still the start of a 30-day challenge. So let's chat, let's have a quick conversation about this. So we obviously rolled out the 30-day challenge for the first time here in August. Then the whole goal was to help you guys put some action items in place and things that aren't just wants and I wish and, and I hope, but things that you absolutely were committed to. And really, I get it, you can go, oh, I'm committed to losing 100 pounds or you know, 50 pounds or selling you know, 20 homes. But what we were committed to was action items, small things that you can commit to that'll, in, in essence, help set up your month for where you want to go, uh, whether that was whether that was business goals, personal goals, all the above. So a few of you guys actually killed it, crushed it with your 30-day challenges, which was awesome. A lot of success stories coming through, but I also heard stories from some of you guys of struggles and things that you fell down on. But guys, here's one thing to keep in mind. Whenever you're setting goals and 30-day challenges, for example, don't think about perfection, think about progression. And if your goal was to work out more, did you work out more in August than you did in July? Most likely, yeah, because you thought about it. You wrote that down, you made that commitment. Now, even if you didn't follow through on 100% of the commitment you told yourself you're gonna do, you still tried, and that's all that matters. But with the start of any new month is a fresh start, a turning of the page and a brand new chapter to be anything you wanna be, create anything you wanna create, and do anything you wanna do. So what does September look like for you? Now, what we wanna do as a team and as your coach and as your, your leader here is, I wanna support you guys with a 30-day challenge. And now, here's the reason for the 30-day challenges. You can one day, once a month, go, oh, I want to sell five homes, or I want to make 25 grand, or 10 grand, or I want more clients, I wanna market more, I wanna be on Facebook more, I wanna lose weight, I want a better relationship, I wanna be more close to my creator, all the above. There's a lot of things we wanna do, but there's a difference of saying, I'm committed. But most importantly, I'm not just committed, here's how I'm going to get there. And guys, that's what the 30-day challenge is about. So for September, what are you gonna to commit to action-wise? Meaning, I wanna sell three homes. Well, well, of course, we all wanna sell, but what are you committed to doing to get there? Well, I'm committed to four Saturday mega open houses, or I'm committed to three Facebook posts per week, or I'm committed to two hours a day of prospecting, I'm committed to send 150 follow-up emails, I'm con committed to send a blast email, I'm committed to sending my newsletters. Do you guys see how the actions are the things that matter? Same thing, right? Man, I wanna lose 20 pounds. I want a lot of things. No, I'm committed to not having fast food for 30 days. Do you guys see the difference in the commitment level for 30 day challenges? That's what this is about. Man, I want a better relationship with my spouse. Well, I'm committed to taking that beautiful lady on four date nights or that, that guy here or a person for you. I'm committed to taking them on four dates over the next 30 days. That's what a 30 day challenge is all about, guys. And here's what I do know. Days start to add up. Because if you want to lose 20 pounds, just start with that next meal. Get committed to it cut off all other options. You don't have another choice. Let's just do this if that's what you wanna do. And same thing with your business. So here's what I would love to hear. In the comment section of Slack, I wanna hear what your new 30-day challenge, but most importantly, your 30-day commitment is. Now, like I said, don't go out and I'm gonna lose 50 pounds. Commit to the actions that you're gonna take that we can hold you accountable to. Something that's targeted, something that's strategic, and something that we can track. So guys, welcome to a new month. I love real estate because you can do anything you wanna do in it, guys. You can literally in 30 days or less, whether you've been with us for nine years or whether you've been with us for nine minutes, you go out today, you can change your financial future. And that's what I love about real estate. Look at Kevin, I mean, guys sold 12 homes in 12 weeks. He has sold more homes in 12 weeks than a lot of agents will in, in one year, let alone five years. He's done it in 12 weeks. That's what's possible. Here's how you get there. You commit to it, you take action on it, and talk to me in 30 days, guys. Welcome to September's 30-day challenge. I'll have my comments in there as well. Talk to you soon, bye-bye.